Hey, what's up? It's a lazy Sunday. Lazy Sunday. And we are on a walk. Uh huh. Look. You probably can't see us very well yeah. because of the well, lighting. This is, this is the view right here. Look at this. Yeah, beautiful yeah. Okay, view. yeah. Look at We're us. We got walk. a beautiful view right here. Look right here. You're about to walk all the way down that way. But yeah. All right. So I was talking to Hobart and I was telling him we need to continue working on our military series. And I was asking him, what's the hardest job in the army? What, what, what did you say? I don't know, there's some dirty jobs in the army. Well, okay, so I was looking online and then there's like the five worst jobs. And I think I was the one who picked one of the worst jobs. In my head, that was the worst job to have. But um, it, when you're looking at all the other jobs, it says like 11 hardest jobs to get into, like <laughs> jo hard jobs to get into, or 10 hard jobs to fill. So I guess if you come from like different angles, I mean, you could say that you could, there's like different ways to look at it. So are, you, are we, uh, in what context are we talking about though? Are you talking about like, the hardest jobs like to do on a daily basis being in that occupation in the military or the good morning uh, the most difficult jobs to jobs do. to get into okay. as far as civilians joining the military right? okay, or joining so, the army so that's so, the what's the context so I guess my thought process was what's the hardest job that we've like looked at people doing and they were hard in our opinion mm. just from like our experience I, I haven't seen you know like i'm not familiar with like a navy seal and you know those kinds of things but i'm talking about like in the army what are like the job titles <laughs> that are hard to do like what's the hardest job title uh -huh. in the army so from our experience, right? I see. And what I would challenge everybody is like, hey, in the comments, <laughs> tell us what you think is the hardest job in the military and why. Hmm. Okay, well, why don't you start? What, what do you think is the hardest job to do no, on a daily basis I was in saying the military? You, you, you tell me. No. Well, Oh, you are you asking me what is the hardest job to do in the military? Yeah, and then I'll tell you mine because okay. I think mine's right and I okay. think yours All is right. wrong. I got it. I got it. I think that before we start, we need to understand that there's two sides of the military. There's the enlisted side and there's the officer side. True. Right. True. Anything that the officers do, um, it's all signatures, authorization, going to meetings and things like that. Making so, some decisions. Making some decisions. So let's go ahead and take the, uh, the officers, officers out of it. The officers' positions out of it because right. the majority of that. We're is, talking enlisted is decisions. here. I'm so we're talking about enlisted. So uh, before I state my comment, I want to uh, put everyone to put it out there, right? That when you are a soldier, you <laughs> you are if you're a soldier and you're brand new in a unit, an organization, and you're the lowest person in a totem pole, it doesn't matter what it is, right? You are gonna do it. So from my perspective, it's either going out there picking up trash or so you know you cleaning out the uh cleaning out the the poop and uh going out there and stirring poop so you he's know, saying or, uh, being a private is the hardest job in the i army? would say that being a brand new soldier being a private in the military is the hardest job and mind you let me let me just give some give some context real quick right so I have been in uh, combat where everyone is wearing their mop gear. Now this is not, mop gear is kind of like their, their gas, gas gear, mask, full mask, full, um, uh, you know, jacket, top, bottom. It's a protective it's system. It's a protective system that like you got gloves on and all this stuff, right? So you, we're on the highest mop level. And uh, according to regulation, right, this is, this is based off of military regulation, uh, to make sure that, to test if the environment is safe, right, uh, they find the lowest ranking soldier. Wow. And they get that guy. You went there. <laughs> you and went I'm there. I'm just saying, you get, they get that guy. They get that guy to take their mask off, right, and to take their gear off to make sure that it is safe. Now, 
Now that right there just, just sets a perspective of what a brand new soldier, the lowest man in the totem pole, the lowest ranking soldier um, has to deal with, okay? And- uh, Okay, but that's not what I was talking I, about. I get it. You I always no, go off topic. No, 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 I think it's the same topic. I think it's the same thing, but I just wanna give everyone else some perspective on how the low, lowest man in the totem pole carries all the weight right now. Now we can talk about the different type of jobs, right, in the military. So from my background is all transportation, logistics, you know what I mean? I was there in the, in the, in the front lines during the uh, Iraq uh, conflict, right, because I was attached to 115th Infantry and we were supporting uh, task force. Can we get to the top? Oh, all right. Gosh, gosh, look at I can't even go into my war stories, you no. know? It was hard. It was rough. Blah, blah, blah. We're talking <sighs> about MOSs. Okay, MOSs. Got it. So jobs and MOSs. See, see this? Um, MOSs. I think the hardest MOS or the hardest job in the military from my perspective would have to be a mechanic. That's me. That's okay, it. I am why? not a mechanic. I why am not a mechanic. though? Why? What do you mean, why? Why? Why do you think the mechanics have a hard time? Like, I have a hard job. If you're a, if you have ever gotten grease in your hand. Oh my God. <laughs> if you have ever gotten grease wow. in your hand, right? Then you'll know that uh, once you have grease in your hand, it's hard to wash it off, paint, oh whatever my it God. is. Right, and it's like it's a it's not a very it's not a very glamorous job, you know what I mean? Greasy hands, greasy guys. Hand. I'm just it's saying. So look, hard. Wait, wait, wait. So you compare so, greasy hands so you compare so you compare that you compare that right? So every day, day in, day out, this this MOS has to go in and be like, God, hot diggity dog, I gotta go in there. No, and then no. The, and, no. And the uh, hot what? hot no. engine, you know, turning bolts. Oh my god! You know, god. nuts and bolts. I'm talking about babe, like, babe, babe. That's you know, not the hardest job. I, in the I army. think it is. I, I, I no. think so. You know. What time do they have to wake up? What's that? What time do they have to wake up? They don't. Have, they don't. They don't. They don't go to sleep until the vehicle's ready. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But no, no, no. No. <laughs> no. Okay. They have a motor pull. They All do. Right. They do. Do they interact with human beings? They do. No, they don't. Yes, they, they do. They just go over there. They turn wrenches. They read a. No, 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 no. That's no. not true. That's not true. Because because that I was. That is an easy job. It's not my MOS, but I'll tell you this. That is an easy job. I had to go in there oh and God. put some pressure and be like, hey, you we, have, a, we have a mission coming up <laughs> and I need these trucks okay. up now. He like, has immense you know, respect. Like I got, he uh, has immense respect look, like for it, the mechanics. Okay? So it doesn't matter what MOS you have. But right? that's because you, he's a truck driver. <laughs> but if he's you an 88 mile. No, 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 and no, look, no. His truck <laughs> can't run if it's not fixed. That's why he likes the mechanics. No, no, no. I said the hardest job, not. Which job do you respect the most? Okay, so what's, what in your perspective, since, well, what is it? What job in your perspective is the hardest? You know what I mean? Well, don't don't say it's a cook, cause that guy it's always the needs cook. to- It's <laughs> no the cook! It's the cook! I'll tell you why. No, way. no, no it's no. the golf series. And no, I'll tell you why. No, 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 I, no. Listen to your, I listen to your greasy hands. No, no. I don't think so. No, go no. ahead, go ahead. I'll let me hear this explanation. The cooks, the cooks have to wake up at four in the morning or earlier to feed the entire unit, okay? And they don't just feed them once, twice, they feed them three and sometimes four times because we even have midnight chow. All right, we're walking by some really loud, See, I'm trying to get interrupted even by nature. <laughs> no, all right. That's nothing against me. I like how you, not, put, <laughs> you put that there. I put that there, wow. All See, right. in this day and age, it's okay. always the guy's fault, but go ahead. But yeah, no, the cooks, they have to get up way early. They have to cook all this food and they have to meet certain regulations when they're cooking the food. And I think they have the hardest job, honestly because of how, how early they have to wake up and how many meals they have to make. Hey, uh, would you like to taste this to see if it is it meets uh, I, I'm daily not a... <laughs> food consumption? I'm not a private, so. All right, uh, would you like to try this? Uh, hey, by the way, what color's the cook's uniform? White. <laughs>
<laughs> okay. So. Oh, that is not the dirtiest job. That is not the I hardest think job. It is the hardest no, job. No, no, no. Okay, so let's just okay. Let oh, me just let me just take it back God. to the mechanics real quick, right? Mad respect. Okay. Oh, mechanics? Why are we taking it back to no, mechanics? No, no. Hey, okay, hear me out. Fine. Hear me out. Okay. So look. So anyone, any MOS out. out there, any any soldier's job out there that has to do with any type of vehicle system and they have to maintain that sucker, all right, they can understand that it's difficult. All right, that's a difficult job. Uh, mechanics are a difficult job. All right. So all it's right. not not only is it dirty, okay. Um, but sometimes, you know, they imagine, okay. Okay, but check this out. Okay, I okay, finish up, and then I wanted to talk about the, the, the article I found. Okay. Go ahead. So, look, mechanics don't only, only uh, turn wrenches, right? If a vehicle's blown up and something catastrophic done, is, is done to that vehicle and they have to fix it up, guess what? They have to face the horrific... Um, the the horrific sight of dealing with this vehicle to uh, get it up right so it's a traumatic event not just for the soldiers right who gone through it the medics who pulled them out but the individuals who had to look at that vehicles afterwards and to fix it back up again so that way they can go out on mission from a combat uh, perspective that's a very difficult thing you know what i mean mechanics don't have to leave the wire you know what i mean and deal with that stuff but guess what um when we were going through from kuwait to iraq the mechanics still had to do their jobs so any vehicles that broken down on the side of the road they had to fix it right there and then right and the thing is there's also a part of the mechanics job that they have to go out out there on every mission there's a mechanic for every convoy out there just in case there's a vehicle that's broken down so Hey, there's a lot of people in the military that are very important to the mission. Okay? I get, yeah, but what I'm All saying is, it's not the dirtiest job. Are you telling me that mechanics' hands are cleaner than a cook's hands? No, no way. <laughs> there's no way. And we're talking about the hardest job to deal with, okay? okay. The hardest job to deal with. All and, right. And, and the thing is, okay, so a cook, can, can he mess that up? Can we I mean, segue? No, into... no, 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 no. Can, can a cook mess that up? Can, how, how, can, how hard is it? To take out what powdered powdered eggs, put it in a pot, warm it up, you know what I mean, and then serve it to people. And Whatever. you know what? They don't even serve it to people. You Whatever. know what they do? They get KP, KP, Kitchen Patrol. These guys have to hey, go in hey, there and clean up. Hey. Like I said, there's regulations, okay? There's regulations. Okay, so All right, but I'm not gonna go can into you, it. Can you counter that? Do you have no uh, counter? No, you no, have no. no counter. I actually like to talk about the uh, the article that I wanted to share. Oh, okay, so here we go. Number five, <clears throat> all right, which I'm very pleased to see is a culinary specialist. All right, so that made the list. But okay, we already talked about that In one. What aspect though? Hold on, hold on. Shower, laundry, and clothing <laughs> repair specialist. I didn't even know that was a thing. But apparently, no, no, it is. no, no. That's not that's not a thing because they uh, they contracted with KBR. Right, right, right. Uh, yeah, okay. at least in con yeah. quarter master and chemical equipment repair. Okay, there's your there's your uh, mechanics. Yeah, all these right? things are repair right okay, there, right? Right, right, right? Let's see here. Okay, uh, number two, mortuary affairs. Now that's a hard job. That's a hard job. Okay. Okay. Okay, I get it. And uh, mm. last but not least, what do you think is number one? Number one on this list of worst jobs in the army. A medic. Water treatment specialist. Oh, get out of here. Get out of here. Water treatment specialist. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Water treatment specialist. Do you know what? These, we, we didn't even get water from those guys. You know what we got? Bottled water. Okay, bottled water. We had rations of bottled water uh, in combat <laughs> in Iraq. We had rations of bottled water. <laughs> but, water but treatment specialist didn't do nothing. This is what it says in here. And the reason is, is because waterborne Ill illnesses are among the most deadly. Whoa. <laughs> But no, because they're they're usually deployed overseas because water is bad in mm. other countries. Number one, mechanics would have to be oh the dirtiest, dirtiest, hardest job, because um, yeah, I've already said that. Number two, I would say it would have to be the medics. The medics, you know what I mean? In the middle of all of this, in the middle of, yeah. of the whole mission, you know, having to deal with with trauma, they gotta they gotta go in there. Right, they gotta save that, drag that individual to safety, start doing, 
all right, their job yep. in the middle of a firefight, all right? Yeah, and no, then, and then do have a really, and really then guess tough what? Job. Guess what? They, they have to go back and they have to deal with the trauma. Right. All right. And so um, you go out there, all right, in any task in any, at any given time, all right, um, from classroom environment uh, all the way to competitions for best warrior, all the way to mission. Medics are alone and they are by themselves. By themselves. A cook has little cook assistants. Okay. Mechanics, okay. you know, they have their little little peons or whatever. I was just saying it's hard to wake up at 5 a.m. Truck or drivers, a. Okay. you know what I mean? They're, they're on their own, okay? Uh, I mean, truck today. drivers are there with their battle buddies, but medics? Yeah, we know your job was pretty easy. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Medics, <laughs> medics. Uh, I think they would have it have it the the rough time. Yeah, medics very do have a hard time. job. How's it going? So, so very difficult time. If I had to say, okay, fine. So maybe I wasn't right about cooks, but I'm just saying I don't want to wake up that many times at late at night cooking. That's a lot of work. Okay, that was my opinion. It was because of the time that they have to wake up <laughs> and how often they have to cook. They have but, to. Uh, Turn the burner on and boil water. Calmate, niño. Calmate. You know what? So anyways. You know what? Hey, that defect was so far away, I'd rather eat MREs anyways. Okay? okay. I'd rather eat Which, MREs. by the way, I want to see you eat an MRE. What? What do you mean? Yeah. I found an MRE in the, in the garage. It's expired and you're eating it. <laughs> That's your dinner. That's your dinner. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna fight after is it, this. Is, it, is that what's gonna happen? Huh? Yeah. Is it? What, what do you mean? Yeah, yeah. You know we're what? gonna have to fight I, after I cook, this. I can cook my own meal. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna boil some water, boy? I'm gonna boil some water. I'm burn, I've never burnt water before. I've burnt water before. All right. All uh, right. Well, hey, we just wanted to bring this topic to you guys. Hope you have a great day. Yeah. And so, uh, if you think that there's a different, uh, uh, more difficult job or occupation out there, other than a mechanic or a cook <laughs> or a uh, medic. medic. Right. Hey, uh, share some of your thoughts of what they have to deal with. Because yeah, I about am the army. really curious. I'm t and it's, it has to be like army specific. Yeah, because okay. we don't know any other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's not talk about the Air Force. Or the Navy. We don't know yeah, nothing yeah, about yeah, this. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Their, their food is all I'm sure catered. they have hard jobs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's not even talk about the Air Force. Okay, so uh, <laughs> Marines on the other hand. Hey, those guys hey, hey, hey. don't even see the defect. So <laughs> shout out to any Marines out there. Uh, but hey, I think the, the, the Army and the Army the marines have similarities but if you have any any comments at all regarding any occupations in the military that's a that has to deal with more difficulties than a mechanic or a cook or a uh, medic uh, leave it on the message below and yeah I'll, uh, we'd like to hear from you I'd guys like to hear from you okay deuces take care